here we are in the district of Morant Clarendon. Clarendon is the largest soil producing parish in Jamaica. And I want to interview one of our leading soil farmers in the parish. Could you please give us your name, sir? My name is Everton Caballero. Mr. Caballero. Yes. Can you tell us how long now since you have been planting soil? Planting soil over the parts, eight years now. Eight years now? Yeah. What, which variety of soil um, do you mostly plant? The bashment. Bashment, sorry. Bashment? Yeah. What is so outstanding about it? Why do you plant the bashment instead of the other? Can you tell it, us why? It bears right through the year. Mm -hmm. every, three month, every three months you plant it. Every, every three months you can plant it and after that you start to reap. Start to reap. Three months after you plant, start to reap. So you are saying then that right throughout the year you have soil growing? Yes, right throughout the year. I'm sorry, going God. I plant two of years because I've sorry for here. I Maybe plant each each month. I plant an acre, okay. and it is by twelve months. I've sorry right to the year. Right to the year. Right to the year. All right. Um, do you have what problems do you encounter? You know, sometime in the plant side because you know farming has its problems, yes. right? And I, I I would suppose that like any other crop, you will have problems with soil. So what what are the main problems? The main problem with really, the bushman sorry. Yes. It's a sorry like I love plenty of water. Uh -huh. So the like, irrigation system of it, because if you don't get water, uh -huh. you're not going to get the tree very high, you're going to get it very low, and low. you don't get no produce on it. Uh -huh. So you can probably plant an acre and you don't reap nothing, low if, you don't get no, if you don't get no water. Uh -huh. What is the major problem? But what about market? market? Yes, and the yeah, most the key part of it mm -hmm. is the marketing. Yes. We don't have the steady market for the sale. Yes. Because many a time I plant it till and it, 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 but I, I don't really make no money because the market is very slow. Okay. So you are saying then, if we have access to irrigation water at the right time and proper marketing, you can make some yeah, money. Yeah, you can make some money from sorry. You can make some money. That can the take water it, yes. and, the, and the marketing. Mm -hmm. The two key for for the for the sorry. So Once is, you have those two things, yes, you, 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 you can make some money for the sorry. So what would be your advice to farmers in, as it relates to sorry? Well, my advice. If you get the, 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 the marketing, that is the first priority. Yes. And the, the irrigation system, land preparation, as you know, yes. you can make some money. You can make yeah, some money. money. Yes, can make some so money. you would encourage? I, I, I would encourage farmers. Yes. You know, if you have a water system, and what I'm saying, the marketing is the, is the more key. Mm -hmm. If you have a good marketing for the soil, mm -hmm. you can make some money. OK. Uh, so this soil that you are planting here now on, the, on this hillside yes. here, the, um, if it germinates now, what time would you begin to reap? Um, if this soil germinate now, mm -hmm. because you see, it's the winter, you got to be a little slower. Right. You got to get the tree more lower yes. and, and lesser produce, but it will come in between January, February. Okay. By January, February, it will do still it come in. Once you get a little water and a little manure, you get it by that time. Well, I do want to wish for you the very best okay, as sir. you continue to do your part in this part of, yes. of the the country to produce soil yeah, I will, I will, for the farmers of Jamaica. I love it Thank you very much, Mr. Continue. Here we want to demonstrate the method of land preparation and planting that farmers use. This to a large extent depends on the terrain and the slope of the place. On hillsides as we have here, we want to demonstrate two methods of planting. One is where the farmer uses his hoe to the goals a meter Apart. Then he plants directly the seeds into the soil. About three seeds are put into each hole, and then at, at molding time, he would thin out two on black. The second method that we want to, to demonstrate is where the farmer uses his oxen. To make the furrows or the drills across the slope. Now I must hasten to show that what we have here is a classic example of what we encourage the farmers to do on the hillsides to practice minimum tillage. Here this farmer he used herbicides to control his weed. And then as we are now seeing, he uses his oxen with the moon board plow to make rows across the slope. 
three, three feet or a meter apart. And the farmer would direct seed, dropping three seeds per hole at a, at a meter apart. And then he would cover up with his feet as we as do you now. At the time of molding, he would then, you know, leaving one. So basically, these are the two methods 